another video and <laughs> before y'all start judging me I ain't desperate so I went um I had a tender day let me just get to the beginning part or whatever so we can get some good juicy juicy stuff y'all know if y'all been following me on my vlogs and everything I went home to Atlanta for the summer and I was like you know what a lot of my friends they're still at their schools because they have jobs over there and a lot of my friends that are in Atlanta they have jobs and internships and all type of stuff and you know I quit my job so I was just here for a minute I was like oh my goodness um I don't know that many people let me just meet some people so my roommate I know that um she met um one of her friends who she's really cool with now like she's met him on tinder or whatever so i was like let me just meet people so i set up an account or whatever i wasn't looking at it as no love connection type of thing just because i think like meeting people online is weird um not that you can't like get married and stuff off of that but that's not what i'm looking for i was talking to different people and this one dude hit me up he would always be like um, I'm doing this I'm doing this we should um, meet up I was just like yeah we should FaceTime and he was supposed to FaceTime me one day after he got off work but he ended up saying he was like yeah I'm on the road right now going somewhere he never FaceTime me we still texted after that he said something like you're a catfish and I was like I'm a catfish what do you mean and he was like you're a catfish because you never um, be trying to like hang out with me and I was like well that's because I don't know if you're like I don't know crazy or deranged you know what I'm saying like I'm not down for just meeting up with people and then I find out that you're like a psycho and you're gonna snatch me up I'm not gonna let you snatch me sir you FaceTime me first and then you snatch me so um yesterday he ended up texting me and was just like hey um, what are you doing and I was like yeah I just finished editing this video I'm about to get something to eat and when I said that you know how you're like I'm about to get something to eat I guess he thought I meant I'm going out somewhere, but really I was like, I'm going to my kitchen, gonna make me a sandwich, and I'm going back to my editing. <laughs> but he was like, oh, well, um, where you going? We should um, meet up. Something in my mom was like, mm, might as well. So I just hit him up and I was like, where are you trying to go or whatever? And I told him, let's go to the sushi place. Y'all know the place I'm talking about, Rusan. So we ended up saying, okay, we're gonna go to Rusan. I was just like, yeah, you know I gotta FaceTime you before I meet up with you, right? And he was like, cool, just hit me up. My hair is on point today, ain't it? Glossy, what girl is doing it to him? Ah. Ended up FaceTiming him, and I left. I put my phone like this, like on the um bed, like I laid it like this, so all he could see is the ceiling. And then once he popped up on the screen, I looked over like this, and I was like, "Oh, you're real? Hey!" <laughs> it was really him, so I was like, "Okay, not that." He's just like somebody who it just really couldn't be, but you know, I was watching. I watch too many catfish to get catfish because if I pop if if from would have popped up on the screen then I would have been very upset and I would have had to fight him I would have had to meet up with him just to fight him that's <laughs> as simple as that right when I FaceTimed him he was like all right so you ready we about to go now he's like you had me waiting for like two hours and I was like um yeah I'm ready I was not ready at all I was like yeah we're gonna meet up at 8 30 it was probably like it was it was like 7.45, so I was like 8.30, and it takes about 20 minutes to, 25 minutes to get to the place. About 8.21, he was like, yeah, I'm here, and I was like, oh, I'm almost there, and I really was just pulling out of my driveway, guys. Like, I was legitimately pulling out of my driveway, and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna have him waiting here forever. I knew I wasn't gonna get there until about 8.00. 45 it was raining there was an accident on a highway oh my gosh it was crazy and I ended up not getting there until about nine o'clock and I was like I'm so sorry <laughs> I pulled up to the place I called him and I was like hey where you at and he was like oh I'm just sitting in my car so he met me at the top or whatever and I seen him walking and I was like okay okay he looks straight he looks straight the type of person that I am I try not to make things awkward and be like hey um weather's nice you know like make it real weird i was just like hey what's up he just kept saying like oh you made me wait this long da, da, da. and i was like he was like i hope you feel bad and i was like i don't 
<laughs> I did feel bad though. One of the servers, he seen me waiting at the top of the stairs for him to come. He was like, shame on that person making you wait. And I was like, I know, shame on him. We ended up um, getting a booth inside and we was just talking like regular like you know just like regular conversation like you don't have to make things weird just because y'all never met before he ended up like picking my order and I picked his because he was like you want to try this you want to try this and I was like no I don't want to try that because he was trying to get me to try seaweed comment down below if y'all have ever had a plate of seaweed I don't know what I've never had it it sounds like it's nasty and he told me it's sweet so I was like no. <laughs> we got a plate of calamari for the appetizer or whatever, which was actually pretty decent. We really didn't eat it at all. It was cool. Like, it was so chill. Like, we was just sitting there cracking jokes. Y'all know how I am. Goofy as hell. Yeah, so it was actually a pretty dope experience. We left and that was that. We were just cool. It wasn't... Was that a date? Was that a date? What the heck? <laughs> Y'all, I'm so slow. I'm so was that a date? I don't think so. I don't know. I guess that was my first Tinder date. I guess that was my first date period. I've never been on a date before you guys. So that was my first date and it was with a stranger. What the heck? But anyways y'all that was my Tinder date experience. If y'all got some crazy stories to tell me go ahead and drop it down below because I want to hear them you know. Also remember to give me a big old thumbs up. Like we always say, I'm just going to go ahead and shield my eyes. If you ain't subscribed yet, go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. You got five seconds. You did it? You good? Okay, cool. Now you're a part of the family. <laughs> but anyways, you guys, until next time, loves. And remember what we always say. Be you, stay positive, and live your life. I know I gave it months ago. I know you're trying to forget I know I gave it months ago I know you're trying to 